Now we will add a limit stop to the piping model. To add a limit stop, let's first add uh, extension of pipe, which is again going in say 1500 millimeters. And at the end of this, so at node 160, it has a positive Y and also a line stop. So let's first add a positive Y at 160 with 0.3 S friction and then let's add a limit stop to it. Now limit stops can also have gap associated with them. So let's say this limit stop has a 10 millimeter gap in it and it also has a friction factor of 0.3. As you can see, CSA2 has added a limit stop to this model. And along with that, it has also added a gap which can be seen in the 3D model here. So that's how you add a limit stop to the model.